for an adrenaline rush. The following contest is the Money in the Bank Ladder Match. To win this match, the winner is the superstar who climbs up the ladder and retrieves the briefcase with the contract inside of it to be cashed in over the next year, anytime, any place. Making his way to the ring from Dayton, Ohio, weighing in at 183 pounds. Wait! Sir to the United States Air Force. Wesley is definitely right at home when taking to the skies. Here comes the Tower of Power, Dijak. And from Worcester, Massachusetts, weighing in at 270 pounds, Dijak! Dijak's a monster, a mercenary, ready to decimate any competitor. I wouldn't limit Dijak's destruction to who's in front of him. He's out here taking people out from all angles. Now, Dijak's throwing bullseyes on anybody he chooses. I personally hope the next target's on you, Saxton. Underneath the scowling face and immense stature, Dijak has an incredible intellect. It's also what makes him so dangerous. The anger that fuels him is compounded by his in-ring IQ. Behold the Nigerian giant. An absolute colossus. When it comes to Omos, there is no preparing, just brace for impact. And from Lagos, Nigeria, weighing in at 400 pounds, the Nigerian giant. We are looking at a confident, angry, malicious Nigerian giant. It is scary how Omos only gets better and more dangerous with each match. Scary athleticism, and even scarier mean streak. WWE, behold the Nigerian giant. And there is no turning back when facing Omos. Here comes Apollo Crews, a man who has evolved to his purest form. And from Benway State, Nigeria, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews! A former United States champion, Won the Intercontinental title at WrestleMania, but Cruz was still struggling to find himself. Yeah, but now that Cruz has found himself, all of WWE is on notice. There's no telling what Cruz is capable of with his newfound focus. Well, if Cruz can truly unleash that untapped aggression we've seen under the surface, nobody's safe. Here comes the lone wolf. From Kansas City, 
you ask Baron Corbin, he will tell you that he is the epitome of what being a WWE superstar is all about. His pass destroyed. Baron Corbin looks to unleash some pent-up aggression here tonight. I, for one, cannot wait to see it. This is one dangerous individual. Hey, from Franklinville, New Jersey. Weighing in at 249 pounds, Joe Casey! Joe Casey calls himself an inclusive figure who wants to create a new normal. And I applaud Casey for doing so. Gacy preach backstage, and I gotta say, he seems pretty insufferable. Well, Byron, what you call insufferable, many of his followers call scripture. And Gacy is all about accumulating followers, accumulating power. to see what Axiom has in store for us on this one. Yeah, hopefully we see some more superhuman feats from him tonight. in all of WWE. And he's also proven he'll rattle everyone's cages and tell some hard-hitting truths. I like this guy. And here we go. The Money in the Bank ladder match is officially underway. All these superstars are ready to try and etch their names in the history books. Ready to secure the briefcase with the Money in the Bank contract. One of these superstars could be a ladder climb away from all but ensuring a championship reign. They just have to get through the others unscathed, which, with all the ladders around in this one, is way easier said than done. Driven into the barricade. A show of disrespect for Frazier. Oh, just turned that around. Getting him into the corner. And what's his counter? Gacy taking it by surprise. And a thunderous forearm to follow. 
And you look at some of the great ladder match victories in history. What do they all have in common, Corey? Fearlessness. You literally have to disregard your own safety to succeed in this match. And with all these bodies, it can get real hairy. The key is to be crazier than the next superstar and the one after them. From the apron, you gotta be kidding me! Uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. Oh, colliding with a barricade. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. He's setting it up on the ring apron right now. You've got to wonder what he has in mind here. And Dijak getting some pushback there. Could be what Omos really needed to push the advantage. Not the prettiest thing you'll ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. What a headbutt. showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. Ladder coming into play here. Oh, something bad's going to happen. Using the ladder as a weapon. Ouch. This match is spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. You can feel the resentment building with each stop there. Him pay with a counter. A loss with great awareness. Oh, straight forward. Baron just adding salt to the wound right now. What a headbutt. Vicious. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Then a thunderous forearm to follow. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Turn your cranium inside out with that. Set up in the corner of the ring. 